Hi, I'm Jeff Doyle. Welcome to this episode of Tracking 200. I'm back in Massachusetts. It's Monday, same place I tracked down two bucks on Saturday and didn't get a shot at the big one. And so I always talk to my dad about my experiences in the woods and we share our stories. And I was telling him how I found all these buck beds, probably close to a dozen of them, as well as a ton of feeding sign. And he told me, he said, I bet that buck's gonna be right back in there on Monday. So looking at the weather, it's uh, close to warm up this afternoon. I didn't bother getting here too early this morning because the snow hasn't changed and it'd be nearly impossible to age a track from uh, two days ago to uh, four days ago. And so with it getting into the 40s today, uh, it's gonna get soft. I'm already starting to see some definition on my own track. And I'd say within the next hour or two, I'm gonna be able to see you know perfect imprint in this snow. So it's gonna be all about speed, seeing how fast I can get onto a, a fresh buck track, big buck track, and then slowing it down and doing what I need to do. So we'll see if we can make it happen today. up here to where the land's kind of leveled out. The bucks come across this creek. I'd say this track is probably from this morning. So it's pretty darn fresh. What I'm going to base that on is looking inside here. You see all the debris all over? There's no debris right in there. Same thing here. No debris in those tracks. So I'm gonna go on this buck. And just by comparison, my all four fingers are fitting inside that sucker. Thank you. 
realize just how much my tracks have aged since Saturday. I don't see anything fresh. It's 2.20 and my plan didn't really pan out so I've got to make some changes. It's pretty warm out here today, so I'm gonna be going short sleeves, which isn't something you can do too often while you're tracking. But I gotta cover a lot of ground right now. I'm just gonna have to see if I can get onto a fresh track. Probably a mile back that way. I was on a good buck track, but I questioned how fresh it was, and it probably was a lot fresher than I thought, seeing how everything's so melted out here today. So I'm gonna just bundle my stuff up, grab my lunch, and start motoring.